What's up, everybody? Uh oh, I may have lost him. I may have lost him on the tre trek here. Dang. I left him at the storage unit. I seen some metal here. Oh, I was gonna see if I could get it out easy. Some of it. that fell off I've got another set though Bed cover. It's got some metal right there, but not enough, I don't think. Alright. Nothing. Zilcho. There's a case. Let's see what's in it. I doubt there's anything in it, but I hate to not know. Feels like there's something in it. Huh. Cool. It's a I mean, probably just scrap it, but still. I wouldn't expect it anything. That's cool.
not in bad shape. Whew. I think I'm gonna leave it. Yeah, that little cabinet is still good. I'll take it. We won't take the cheeseburger wrapper though. Dang, there's a recliner in that one. Too bad. It's just on there with Phillips. You could probably, well, no, it's bolted to the side too. Be a lot of work, but there's metal on there. Oh well. Oh, it's a blank. It's gonna be a short video, I think. <laughs> Once we run into something. I'll see a tin. I'll hold some oil filters later on, maybe. Unless oh, it's full of junk. Books. Take that though. some metal in here. I don't know what all, but a high chair. We can take that. Bread box. I want to keep that actually. That's a treasure. It's yard sale material. It's a mess out here. I don't know. Oh, there is. A lamp, a metal lamp on top of that. I'll take that for sure. Uh, 
of the land. Dumpster's a good one. Yeah. Yep, I carry one thing at a time. My dude's gonna get pissed at me. You know what? I really don't care. I've explained myself quite a bit why I take one thing at a time up there to a dumpster if you're wanting to know. That's because just in case somebody shows up, I will have it in the truck already. You know what I mean? So, that's my reasoning again. I got two pieces this time. Everything has a cord with it almost, so that's good. What is this? <laughs> if it wasn't so some dumpster art. Wax burner. Somebody got a salon business, didn't they? Now the hair cutting business. Scrappity say here, fluffing the video. That's what I'm doing. Oh, I gotta get down though. Got it wedged in there. Yeah. This one's going straight to the shrimp pile. So I'll get the brass off of it. messing with them motors the bigger ones I do well that 
That's cool. This truck type deal it looked like that one. Still in packages, Amazon packages here. That was like a few days ago. Three open tops here to school. Yeah, a little bit of cat five wire. There's nothing in that one. <clears throat> Get it like that. Yeah. Get some of these bigger pieces. It was real. Cat files dropped a little bit. Uh, so that one don't have nothing in it. Let's see if I can open that, dude. It'll save us some time. Let me get this picked up before we get in there. I seen it at first I got excited I thought it might be copper but it's just cat five bar which is still like mm -hmm. 65 75 cents a pound at the moment Shred. You can still shred this stuff. got it that's just PVC and that's plastic so, I'll lock this back dollars thinking we might have some stuff in here by 
how to look someone's on top. Oh, I thought we had a foliage here. We have a backpack. Decoy for duck hunting. I will grab them. I've got buddies that duck hunt, so. I mean, there's what, four ducks in there? So, in the decoy bag, it's probably worth something, isn't it? Yeah. Worst case scenario, I'll just throw it in my trash and nobody wants it. Sometimes they have lead weights on them, so. Ugh, fudge. That old mattress has been stuck in there forever. Hey, puppy dogs. We can scrap that, right? I'm saying we can. Metalish. I don't know. I see a little free pile. Let's see if there's anything that I want. too good though did it? I think it just closed yeah on we go I've got us a volleyball my daughter likes playing volleyball so let's get her an extra one for free let's get us some oil filters a little bucket we can fill up Let me open that other door where y'all can see a little better. Happy Father's Day. To all the daddy o's out there. Hope y'all are having a good day. This probably won't be out till tomorrow, but... Happy Father's Day nonetheless. So far mine's been good. Wife made me cat head biscuits in my in my cast iron skillet with some chocolate gravy. Uh, and some scrambled eggs. It was darn good. If you hadn't tried chocolate gravy, you should Google it and try it. It's pretty easy to make and it's yummy. Coons approved. My go-to, one of my favorites. As you can tell by my healthy figure. Oh, that's a golly, that's a big one right there, isn't it? Big one, boys. That's full. <laughs> Bring the dishwasher, fill it up. We really want to do all that though. <sighs> There's a lot in here this week. Dusty, but clean it off and use it. Yeah, I 
gas one back at four. My whole idea was it never ever goes as planned because I'll use it for something else. But that tote, I think it would leak oil in the back of my truck if I put it in the dishwasher though. So, anyways, we got some, a few pounds. There's some, there's some stuff in here today. We're gonna have to pull on up and probably back up to it where we can look in there. Let's do that. Take the stick. In case we need it. I just seen some wires and stuff, so. We'll turn all this back over. Uh, Maya uh, got overzealous. We're overexcited. Nothing too great in here, is there? Oh, man, I got overexcited. Maybe not. Some wires. Oh, yeah, look there. There's a big one of wires. Asbestos. I don't know if it is or not. You're looking at it real good. Best chances will be down there. I can't get that up. I ain't gonna. Let's look in the stay out of dumpster, no dumpster diving. Dumpster, just for fun. Oh, don't say nothing. I didn't get in it, I stayed out of it. I just looked. It's a plumbing warehouse. I'm sure they have a bunch of people always making a mess. That's why they got the sign up. Or another scrapper, somebody put it up for. But I would say, most likely, the business did. I'm going to have my truck on camera. Does anybody recognize this truck? I'll be on the, the local Facebook. Look out. <laughs> Whatever. He looked in my dumpster. Let's go look in this dumpster. This is the beauty salon where my wife used to work. It's also there's like an automotive that shares the same deal, but they but they don't ever they save their scrap. I see a cord right off the bat. Is that a cord or a serpentine belt? Ah, it's not a serpentine belt, but some kind of something. Oh, we got some wires though. Oh, we got to see if that works. I doubt it works. Let's just try it right now. The magnet. Holy crap, if that works, guys. If that works. I don't know. I doubt it does. Oh, I just shot it right out of there, didn't I? Yeah. Does it have an on switch? Well, that's why they threw it away. My cigarette lighter don't work. I don't know. There we go. Still pretty cool though. We could, uh, those magnets are pretty strong. We could paint that up and put scrap on it like Mr. Paul. 
I got some paper towels here. They're all soggy and wet. Rock, be quiet, you're gonna get me in trouble. Oh. Boy, this dumpster has been good to us. And I swap, I spy with my green eye. Something really good. Lots of little stuff that's good. Lots. gaggle of wires isn't it folks <clears throat> well y'all can see there's no getting in this dumpster either because it's so full so you just have to hook it Yep, one piece at a time there, DW. Get in my truck. I wish I had a tote or something here. This was probably the find of the day. I mean, it's junk wires. What, about 35, 45 cents? There's not much number two in there, but a little bit. And that's about 75, 85 cents here. Well, I mean, not even here. I have to drive to the closest place to pay anything good is on that is bid vultures yard. People ask me why I drive that for. It's not that. It's like an hour and 35, 45 minutes. So I usually just save up. Take my S10 when I go or Sonoma. Wires up. A few more wires down there. Not much. There we go. Yeah, so I spend probably 40, 50 on gas to go up there on the right now. Come back with there's a couple. There's some more. There's there's some more.
I'm trying to get that one right there. No copper left behind. And if I can get this, I don't want that. That's nothing. I thought I had this. Is this one? This is what I wanted. There we go. A couple little brass pieces on there. trinkets here and there and they all add up this dumpster's been good to us folks i'd like to see what else is in the bottom here so let's, let's get down to it again That's right, whatever's some more oh, busted screwdriver we can scrap that it's an automotive place as well I think what this place does, they buy old trucks. Probably. Well, this is such a good dumpster. Well, I know they buy trucks. It's, it's, a, it's a dealership. But I'm sure they take some in on trade, you know, or something. And then sell them. Ugh. I mean, then. Yeah, sell them, but like clean them out. Now you're telling what they find in them. That's my guess. This is stuff from cleaning out trucks that they get on trade and stuff. Or maybe even repossess, I don't know. But we got a good mess of wires. A good mess, as my uncle would say. hollering at her kid not me <laughs> told him to get in the damn house poor old feller he's trying to play outside <laughs> got some aluminum here i left that radio going a little too loud didn't i Let's see if we can hook it there oh. 
that's a hard one to get. Whew, steady hand. I'm a dumpster star. No sticky sticky. Weighed about half a pound, so that's 20 cents in the truck. Let me turn that down. There's a washer right here, and I think that's for scrapping to take. It's right on the curb. Mr. Richard lives right there. A scrapper. So it's on the curb. I'm gonna take it. It's right at really. He just had to walk over here. this the hard way it's in the truck huh there's a quarter too I'll take that too <clears throat> it is on the curb <laughs> like yeah mr. Richard scrapper right there Big Rick for my videos. <laughs> Coons is. He may not want people to know where he lives, so. He might be like me too, don't like to scrap on his own street. Well, there's an air conditioner, but I don't know. Maybe that. I don't know. Coons is the back of my truck now. I don't know. There's scrap all over that yard. Maybe they're scrappers. I might be on the news. <laughs> shouldn't have put it on the curb again <laughs> on trash day ah. <laughs> I don't know that was kind of exciting on we go I was like I was thinking it was at his house and I was just like well just to make sure ah. what is that a burnt doorknob burnt chunk of metal it's actually kind of Couple pounds. Hey, gross the roll, man. Where's our keystones pulling the back? Stuff full of cans. Oh well. Well, we are back home. Not much, really. I mean, it's a full truck. It's just because I didn't stack it good. I mean, we found a dishwasher. Some wires and that big old gaggle of wires. Uh, this dryer, man, that was weird. It's right there next to Mr. Richards or Big Rick. He likes to be called Big Rick. <laughs> uh, house, he's a scrapper. But like, I know those people that live next to him are crackheads. Well, he, because he was complaining about them. Well, he thinks they are. So I'm not some, who knows what crackheads do, man. They had on it, like, maybe for their property line. <laughs> I don't know, man. But they had like a TV over here and then an air conditioner over here against, I don't know, it was weird. So maybe I stole a crackhead's dryer, but it was right on the curb. Oh, here's a sign on it. Oh, I say here's a piece of paper. If I was gonna say free, I wouldn't have felt so bad, but it was on the curb, man. So it's in my truck on trash day too. So yeah, it wasn't, uh, we got those a decoy bag with three or four duck decoys in there. I'll give to my buddy if he wants them. If not, oh well. 
yeah that's it so happy father's day to everybody and uh yeah i had uh i had fun i've had worse days so i ain't gonna complain about finding free scrap so y'all guys have a good one thanks for all the comments i was reading the read them a while ago on my last video for the happy father's day wishes thank y'all very much y'all guys have a good one i'll see y'all on the next one